Welcome to today's video and another episode of Two Minute Tuesday. In today's video, I'm gonna be giving you a very simple yet effective tip to help you restructure your day to get the most out of your strength training and injury prevention training. So we all understand the benefits that strength training has on reducing injury risk. However, what most people do is that they combine injury prevention and strength training in the same session. In my opinion, the two are very different. Injury prevention training involves lots of low intensity, high repetition based exercises that isolate individual muscle groups and focus on mobility. Whereas strength training on the other hand involves very, very high intensity, heavy or dynamic explosive movements. The two are very different. Most people, however, combine the two in the same session. In my opinion, and the best use of your time is to incorporate roughly a 30 minute extended warm up prior to your tennis specific warm up, whereby you focus on these lower intensity, high repetition movements to isolate muscle groups and focus on mobility prior to then moving on to your tennis specific warm up. In the afternoon, when arguably your hormones are at a more optimal level to perform at your best, this is where you focus on maybe just two, three, or maximum of four high intensity strength based explosive movements. I've incorporated this with my athletes over the last 18 to 24 months with really good results. For me, I've tend to found that there's no confusion between sessions. The athlete understands what the purpose is and what it is they're trying to achieve. In the morning session, they're there to prepare the body and reduce injury risk. In the afternoon, they're there to develop performance. Not only does it allow the athlete to switch on mentally, psychologically, and prepare themselves best for that particular session, but for me, it's also best use of the time based on hormones being optimally raised in the afternoons in preparation for peak performance. If done with the right intensity and volume, and therefore enough recovery in between sets is performed, a typical strength or performance session might take you an hour to an hour and a half to complete, even if you're focusing on just two or three quality exercises alone. Dividing this time Time across a myriad of other exercises that are there to help reduce injury risk is only going to cause an additional level of fatigue, it's going to make the athlete unaware of what the purpose of that session is, and it's going to be a huge waste of time. You're effectively putting too many eggs in one basket. So consider separating the sessions. A 20 to 30 minute dedicated injury prevention session prior to tennis specific warm up is arguably going to improve the quality of the tennis specific warm up. Muscles in isolation are going to be functioning much better. You can then leave all of your efforts, both physically and mentally, toward the performance enhancing type training session that you are then going to have later on in the afternoon. I hope this tip helped. I think I did actually stick to the two minute time frame this week, which is a massive success for me. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit subscribe and the bell icon next to that button in order to receive notifications of our next release. I'll see you in the week.